Okay, well, welcome back to Rogue Survivor. Loaded it up, and in the basement of the police HQ here. I'm a little bit sleepy and don't have any hit points. Unfortunately, I even though I have carpentry, I can't build a bed. Can't build a bed to sleep on. What do we got? Uh, I guess we'll pick up the scent killer again. Apply that. Come back here. I'm actually going to sleep um, back through here, and I'll kick down this door. And it doesn't matter how far back I run, as long as I've um, got a door in front of me that'll wake me up if they start beating on it. Because ultimately, if there's a lot of them, I'll have to either dance around and try to get away, or stand my ground and fight and die anyways. So we'll sleep. It's currently day 3, hour 19, evening. And we're going to drop down the floor, the wood floor, and pass out for the evening. Hopefully, day four will bring a little bit more sunshine our way. Yeah, not regaining any hit points while sleeping on this floor. And we're going to be hungry soon, so... This is not good. We're going to wake up... Um, I guess whenever it decides what it's ready for us to. There we go. So we'll pick up this again. Our scent spray. Start heading out. Didn't really do us any good to sleep. We're now really hungry. I guess at least we won't be exhausted. Oh man. Is there any food down here in the police HQ? Do they have a vending machine anywhere? Any donuts? Some shotgun ammo. A bunch of boards over here. Dead bodies all over the floor. Someone destroyed all this stuff here. An angry zombie must have ran through while I was sleeping in the other room. Or one of those zombies before that we killed. Oh well, damn, nothing in here that we can use. We'll get out. Well, I can't go up the stairs and survived another day. Martial arts medic or light sleeper we'll put another one we'll put I guess we've already got light eater so we'll pick up light sleeper too um, I can't go up the stairs something's blocking my way there so we'll go down and through then oh, wow what do we got here we got people in here oh wait no there's a zombie Julian there's another zombie in there all zombies locked up. Everybody who's locked up in jail has been starved to death and turned into a zombie, I think. Audrey, Austin, Frank Lassant, Chrissy Quinn, Allison Carpenter. There's a lot of people down here. Fiona Dobbs. Psst, hey, you over there. The prisoner who should not be is discreetly calling you from his cell. You listen closely. Listen, I know I shouldn't be here. Just drive a bit too fast. Look, I know what's happening. I work down there, at the char facility. They didn't want me to leave, but I did. Like I'm stupid enough to stay down there. Now listen, let's make a deal. Stupid cops wouldn't listen to me. You look clever, however. You just have to push this button to open my cell. The cops are too busy to care about small fish like me. Then I'll tell you where is the underground facility, and just get the hell out of here. I don't give a fuck about char anymore. You can do what you want with them. Do it, please. I really shouldn't be there. Looks like he wants us to turn the generator on to open up all the cells. Hmm. I'm not real interested in letting out all those zombies there. The prisoner who should not be. Somehow he's still alive. Um, we'll let him out, and then I'm going to sprint as quickly as I can down the hallway, I think. Oh god. No, go after him. Go, don't, not me. Yep, they're chasing him. Is there anything in here? Nope. Was he a zombie? No, he's running now. So, let's see, we got those ten pills. Oops. I punched the zombie and she turned around and bit me. A <laughs> reason hit. So, you join the room of the undeads. Game over. Well, we know that that guy is there now, so if we ever make it back to the police HQ, we can pick up that quest again. Hopefully, um, be a little bit more prepared for it. Let's see, Lisa Cordell, a woman and a civilian. She survived to see day four, hour eight. Guided her for 33 minutes, and then she 
ended up dying as soon as she loaded the game up and came back. Um, let's see. Sighted zombie master, skeleton, first man, and woman. Saw the zombies before I saw anybody else, it looks like. Uh, ran into the prisoner who should not be and offered him a deal. Rest in peace. So we'll see who we load up next. I think we're going to do another character. There's my longest one, 14 days. That was a pretty fun character. And I ran into a zombie prince who... I'm not sure if that... I thought that zombie was um, a zombie prince that killed me. Anyways, stay away from zombie princes if you see them. Let's see, we'll do a new game. Choose random again. Another female? Why not? And we'll pick up Carpentry once more. Same as the last character. As long as we're not Lisa Cordell again. We are Tori Carpenter. The Carpenter. And let's see. There's already plenty of people in here. We start with a pistol next to us. So we got a pistol and some scent spray. We'll pick this up. Take that. Take the scent spray. And we'll spritz ourselves already right off the bat. Um... There's another pistol. We'll check up here. So there's still plenty of survivors around, not a lot of zombies. It means there's all the good supplies outside. It's deep night. Just get out of this apartment. And we are in a green district. There's a skeleton. I want to get out of this green district. Get out of my way, skeleton. You're worthless. He claws us, and that's it. With any luck, maybe we can find a shopping district. Residential district. It's not too bad. Take that, that's good, till day one, hour eight. More groceries. Day two, hour sixteen. Day one, hour twenty. You really should be picking up some of these friends, Julian McGreedy. You're going to be wishing you had. Even if they are just bags of vegetables that go bad. And a box of ammo. We're already starting out pretty good, Tori. Staying alive since day zero. And where is the police station? Police station is at 4-3. I believe that the first 4 is over here and 3 is here. So way down here in the, in the... In the bus district? The business district? Currently we are at... 3-2. So we are here. We need to head southwest a little bit. I want to get back to the police station. And she's willing to trade us some groceries for groceries. Nope. Take this hunting ammo. No, never mind. I don't want to drop anything. Try not to pick up stuff I don't need just yet. Groceries for groceries? Nope. There's more groceries there. Get out of my way. Blown up cars all over the city. Skeleton. No point in wasting one or two hit points on him. Another pistol and a cell phone. You have survived another day. Medic, Martial Arts, or Awake? Um, let's go ahead and choose Awake. That way I don't get completely exhausted and tired. If I don't get my sleep, my beauty rest. Down out through here. We'll go down this exit into the next district. Leave 3-2? Yes, absolutely. We're now 3-3 three, three, and we're heading... So this is where we are, and we want to head to the west now. Oh, dang, there's already a zombie there. Time passes. It is now morning. Hello, friend. What are you willing to trade? Groceries for a wooden plank. I'm almost willing to actually come back. Groceries for a wooden plank? Yes. And those are good for day one, hour 21. Not bad. I'm not sure why she'd be willing to give up. Hey kind of want to pick up this shotgun and shotgun ammo. So we'll drop this scent spray and eat one. This is good for day 121, 120, 108. Take that. Now we've got a close close quarters combat weapon. You can use the pistol to pick people off from a distance and the shotgun for when they get it right up in our face. There's a bunch of police officers here. Wait up, where are you guys going? Is there a central meetup location or something? Is there a bunker we're all looking for? He offers light pistol bullets for some light pistol bullets. Nope. Not unless you got armor piercing there you're willing to trade for. 
I would trade 20 regular pistol bullets for 10 armor piercing. Zombie meat piercing. Uh, I don't think I can dig anything with the shovel. I'm not going to take that. We'll go to this next station. This next one. This should be 4-3. And then we'll start combing through the streets looking for the police office. Police HQ.